So I decided to have a walk around the area I'm staying. And really, <laughs> it is a bit damn market this area. But the thing about it is the graffiti is quite interesting. And we're starting to lose the light, so I thought I'd better go around. This was one time a pub. Apparently it was owned by one of the stars of Crossroads. I don't know if you remember that one. I think it was Crossroads. Anyway, so there's quite a bit of graffiti around here. So, and you've got this um, railway arch. I'd say that was a pub then. I believe it's got squatters in it at the moment. Let's have a look at the graffiti. We call this graffiti walk, eh? It's a bit of a shitty day, but um, so I don't know. Can we zoom back? No, well, that's it. There, it's even quite blowy. I think this was a red light area. <laughs> you never know, do you? Because, as I say, I mean, I'm like you, it's the first time I've been here. So there's quite an let's have a look at this have a look at the greasy for a second there. So that's quite an interesting building there, isn't it? What what was that building? There's a bus, that'd cost to be about that bus, wouldn't it? I think it's a musician's type bus or something that looks like a generator. So this is a university college, that building there. So maybe they may have some sort of band on there, just a guess. So you can see that door, you know, a bit secure, and a train up there. I'd say them painting the outside of the building, doesn't it? Makes you really wonder what's going on in there, doesn't it? Seems to be some sort of plant, maybe it's a bar or something. Bits of graffiti everywhere. So there, look at that, some lights. So this was J. Wilde and Company, 1940, Red Brick Market. There seems to be a little market. So I say I'm not far from Digwood bus station, not far from the Bullring either. So the big bake Birmingham. So So 
apparently this is a nightclub area, you know what I mean? Things happen here at night, the floodgate. I mean, it could be a bar. Yeah, definitely. I know it looks like, um, I can't remember. It's not bowling, but it's one of those things. Isn't it? Fun house. Live music, cocktails, and fun, and more. So apparently, you can hire those bikes over, bikes over there. That's too graffiti. Some sort of railway yard. I presume it's like a car park. As I say, this area is popular at the weekend, you know, for um, nightclubs. I think they have a lot of illegal raves here, but don't quote me. So I've heard. So there's a bar there. It looks like a traditional type bar, you know. Which is unusual because most of these look like warehouses or I don't know, to me they look like a bit of a railway trunk. Should we have a little peep in? Ooh. As I say, like, that's the railway there. King. Let's say there's a traditional type pub. Well, I think it's a pub anyway. Freedom Rooms, Freedom Breweries, Brick Pop. Little Anne Street. There it is, Freedom. I bet that's this is a busy air on a Saturday. Still pissing down with rain. I don't want to go too far from where I'm staying because I need Google to get me. I think I'm staying down here on the left, but um, we'll see. So, if you're into Gravisi, then it's, this is the area to come to, isn't it? So, there's an industry in institute there. You can see it's how, how much rain's about, you know. I mean, look at that's actually got a camera up there, you know. I mean, this building looks absolutely derelict, but they're like nightclubs. Strive forward with ambition. So if you're into the graffiti, this is the place to go. Screen and Film School Performance College. So if you look down there, look at so modern. And it's so, I don't know, it's so, I don't know, need a bulldoze in some of this path. Little Land Street, Birmingham. It has character, so maybe the new buildings there they have character, or maybe like the old buildings here. The Barn Street Diner, Little Land Street. <laughs> what a name for a street! So you can see the railway bridge there, and you can see that we're starting to lose the light. I'm actually lost, you know. So you've got some buddleia there, that's a, a really bad plant. People quite like it though, but I mean it'll grow in concrete, it'll destroy your house, you know. It'll go into the foundations. So 
So we seem to have lost the graffiti and I've lost my way. So thanks for watching my videos and remember to put a like and maybe put a comment. So if you're into, into graffiti, this is the area to come. It's not far from Birmingham city centre, it's not far from the Bull Ring. And uh, it's like Coventry Street, Little Land Street. Just Google it and you'll find it, you know? And if you're into like going out at the weekend and getting fucking shit faced and you're young, this is the area to come to. So there it is. Have a great day, have a great evening, be happy.